Hey guys, I'm Tim. I'm Bob. I'm Spencer. I'm Dan. This is Board Game Rundown. Today, we are going to unbox Ghostbusters Men in Black Ecto Terrestrial Invasion. Yeah. Right. Fun IDW Christmas. Games. This is uh, one to four players. It says ages 14 and up. I have no idea. Uh, so, this is a one of the last IDW games that games. IDW I is like uh, making. Box. Oh, yeah. Ooh. And uh, Ooh, so, in this game, it. it's like an alien named Zorg, which I Zorg. don't know. If that's a Toy Story reference, Zerg, <laughs> Zerg, Zorg, pretty close, right? He crashes his ship into the Ghostbusters firehouse, and he is like sucking energy out to like fuel his ship. So aliens are coming through, okay. and then because there's aliens, the guys from Men in Black, so J and K, K, and probably somebody else. Because start know. naming other. Oh, letters. it is J and K. I believe it is J and okay. K, uh, specifically. So there's a whole tray of minis there, yeah. right there. Mm -hmm. You guys yeah. can. Slide Get in there. Over here, yeah. That's this Ooh, is a dice tower. Yep. Is that what that is? And yeah, so it's gonna you're gonna assemble that and then it's a pentagon. There's a bunch of I didn't know the Ghostbusters were in the Pentagon. Mm, the secrets Woo! keep coming. There's a little alien guy. Got oh nice. Oh, here he goes. <laughs> that was these are, a these are really the solid. Century. They are. They're they're really chunky. Uh, chunky. They are they're yeah. nice and I solid. Like big. I'll let you guys look at the dice. Oh. <laughs> He's like Dice. coming out of the marshmallow man there. So is that supposed to be like Rip Torn? Pretty certain. All yeah, isn't that agent or isn't That's he the boss? Yeah, Rip Torn's oh, yeah, the boss. He's yeah. got the flashy thing. Don't flashy thing me. Have you ever flashy thing me? Yeah, there's Jay. Yeah. Also, yes. <laughs> nice. So there's different types of aliens that we will be encountering: the Ooh, grapple gore, the tentacle, Zorg puffed. So that's like the robot. Oh. Stay Puff, Puff crossover. Oh, that's okay. funny. Okay. Edgar the Bug. Oh, God. It's so gross. <laughs> yep. The Stay Puff and head stay is Puff. on his oh, so shoulder. There's an actual Stay Puff somewhere. So it looks like, oh so this is campaign based, look at right? The goggles. I love the goggles. Oh, they look yeah, so good. I, I like those. He's got the trap. Yeah, it's, it's awesome. So we got player boards, and when you're playing this, you're going to you're going to pick a Ghostbuster, and you're going to pick an MIB agent, oh. and so each player is going to control two, two characters, okay. and then so you're working together. I think it's semi co-op, but there's a way for one person to win, like employee of the month. <laughs> okay, yeah, nice. <laughs> so so then is you that can... really winning though? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it, with Bob and I, it is definitely winning. Definitely winning. Uh, so these are bits of the ship. That are going to uh, fit into that tower. Yeah, I figured, and that's uh, what holds it together. And that's then, sick. so so dice, the dice are going to represent aliens, and then they're going to go into the tower. Uh, and I then, when it. things come out, then the dice come out of the tower. Depending on the die face, is going to tell you what kind of alien then spawns I on love the board. It. Nice. That's kind of all I know about the game. I don't really know anything else about it or how it you plays. Got three different levels of cards here, together. but I like the, there's the back of them. Uh, I don't think that's recording. But yeah, there's the a pictures. ton of stuff. There's this, no picture there. Oh, it's, it just goes black. Okay. It's red. It's recording. Cool. <laughs> but yeah. So, anyways. Not that I can like show people. A whole bunch of tokens. <laughs> here you go. What do we got here? Uh, item cards, that's I believe. Piece of oh, the facts ship, are right? different as well. Yep, for that's a part of the ship. So the ship will be sticking out of various parts, and so like events are going to occur. So you got different kind of item cards here. Interesting. And they're different levels. Level three, level one. So uh, how it holds tokens. On. That's what I was looking for. Which one? The books? Just the books. Yeah. I like this. You got the traps here. Sure, there's a the power pack there. Oh, I'm sure. I like to give Scenario the book. give the uh, the men in black people packs as well. That's nice. Somewhere in there, I would assume. The traps. No, Maybe no, not. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, so we have definitely could be a. Yep. Well, it looks like yeah. Like here that. are all the starting weapons. Right. Each player gets their own starting weapon. So and it is J. Uh, it's interesting. It is Agent J, K, and L, and then Chief Z, which is Rip Torn. Uh, Who's L? Uh, I'm guessing girl? she's from the Chris Hemsworth movie. Oh, and, okay. Uh, Tessa yeah. Thompson. Yeah. She, she's the, uh, the first yeah, yeah. Oh, it's not the Tessa Thompson character? Okay. It's not Valkyrie? It's, it's Valkyrie? It's <laughs> okay. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember yeah. now. Oh, yeah. She become. I totally forgot she even becomes a Men in Black. Yeah. Awesome. 
And I think they think he's also men in so black the on like oh, the cartoon. Never mind, Bob. <laughs> I was about to say, so the tower's supposed to be a square, not a pentagon. Yeah, he figured it, it out. Square, yeah, it, out. it, it <laughs> overlaps. Oh, but I didn't forget to put the little base floor here. But I think one of the those starting out. characters is the secretary. What's your name? Right, so Janine. Pull these back out. Yeah. It looks on the back of those starting character cards. Janine. This is Janine one of them? She's the secretary, right? Yeah. I mean, that, that's Annie her, Potts? right? Annie Potts? Yeah. So you can be Slimer? Of course you can be Slimer. I don't know who, th- oh, uh, I don't know who that is. Uh, Bank- Slimer's the jeweler? Slimer's a good guy Bankman. No. That's no. not Venkman. No, I was talking about that's Jeb. I can't tell who Jeb that is. or Jeebs. Jeebs. Wait, wait. So you aren't actually playing any of the original? No, I mean you gotta have Egon and stuff in here, right? Somewhere. If you've yeah, got yeah, yeah. J and K and yeah, the, it's Peter, Egon, Ray, and Winston. Okay, yeah. the, okay, the okay. Four playable characters and then Zedmore. Yeah, love it. So uh, right on. I yeah. see. I see. So those are. And we're we're gonna make sure to check the bottom. There's them. nothing yeah, in the okay, bottom. Yeah, always do that. Always but check. If one time we didn't do that, we missed something. Yeah, I know, right? I will Never say uh, the insert is pretty good. Comes with a bunch of bags. I love that because there's a ton of tokens to punch out here. So I mean, the insert looks like it has a, a zombicide style board system. Looks huh? like, and you build the map uh, based on the scenario. And then you can you can play it campaign style, oh, so nice. items that you unlock oh, and yeah, upgrade. Oh yeah, the character boards are even kind of zombicide-y. I wonder. A if the, bit. Yeah, this is interesting. Okay, I believe we got some players. Right, let's give it a shot. Let's see how those dice go. Uh oh, so the dice get caught up. Yeah, so that's that's why when like different events come and uh, they might pull something out uh, and then more dice fall out. Very oh, cool. cool. So right. so it's you're unique. and again what the die face showing. Uh huh. Is, like is what then happens. what spawns. Okay. And then, like, um, Very cool. when you're rolling your dice uh, as as a Ghostbuster or an MIB agent, you can either attack together, which is crossing the streams, nice. where you have both guys attack. I thought it was a bad thing. Well. In this game, it's a good this thing. This game, it can be a good thing. Okay. Those but are you so- can. Oh, nice. <laughs> EPA <laughs> violation. <laughs> oh, no. I can't even quote my favorite line from Ghostbusters. I know, me neither. <laughs> is this true? Yes, it's true. I won't say anything else. Um, but anyways... So when you're rolling to hit, basically the die face is going to tell you what kind of aliens you can hit. Okay. And then there's bonuses if you're if you're teaming up and crossing the streams. Nice. Which yes would be a very very bad. So thing. pulling <laughs> those out is a psychokinetic disruption. Uh, so here are the character cards. Evidently. So we've got Winston, Egon, Ray, Peter, Agent J, Agent K, Agent L, and Chief Z. I want to be Agent K. Oh, Agent K talks I like this. I want to be Peter. <laughs> because right, so Tommy Jones got... has no idea how to be anyone except himself. Everybody, w- true. everybody should want to be Venkman. I know, <laughs> right? You're more of a Ray, though. Yeah, I am more of a Ray. Unpopular yeah. opinion. My, j- jumping back a little or bit. Egon, my favorite really. quote from Ghostbusters is yeah, from I the second too. Ghostbusters. I'm tall like Egon. Your favorite what? Dogs and cats living, living together. together. Mass hysteria. hysteria. No, that's a good one. But no, the uh, short but pointless. <laughs> that's oh. one of my favorite <laughs> things I've ever heard. There's oh. so many good lines. I've been using that IRL. <laughs> I know. I love it, man. <sighs> but uh, so this is just like a real quick. If you uh, if you bought this off the shelf, this is what this you're going to get. Yeah. Uh, so we are actually going to probably play this like okay. right now, and then we'll do a review. So if this looks interesting to you or interesting enough, check the channel because we'll have a review of it probably pretty close to the same time oh, this video these. comes out. Like we have it's like four comic scenarios. book style. So, oh, wow. Nice. Yeah, and the scenarios are done in books like comic books. Yep. It's pretty pretty and, rad. And it comes with a storybook that is just the comic book that tells you the prequel. Like what's happening. Where, which how every... am I holding this? Yeah. Uh, you know, tells you how we got here. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, blah, no. Blah. Spoilers. You started at the end. Oh. Yeah, Just you did. Kidding. You totally went backwards. Oh, but yeah. Man. Bonus episode number I know four. I went backwards for this because I flipped, and then I realized that it was faced the wrong way, so then I unflipped. <laughs> but I will tell you also, like, there's yeah, it's, wait, uh, one of two main sheets. villains from the first movie. The rule book also has a thing I love, which is just on that back quick page. Thing, just yeah. has a nice quick yep. reference that tells yep. you everything. Yep. So, yep. so far, really excited to check this out because it, it's doing a lot of things right. Mm-hmm. The dice tower looks really neat. The style is good. The, like style, the, the cartoony art style is fun. And I think that all the miniatures are kind They're of, good. I'm not going to lie, surprisingly good. Mm-hmm. Like I was not, I did not have high expectations, but I feel yeah, like, I like these, these are all, these are all pretty solid. They look good. Uh, they're not like super detailed, but they're not so, they're but not, they fit, but the they style. don't need to be super detailed. So the bad guy models all look like they could be in Monsters, Inc. A little bit, a <laughs> little they bit. Have that, they have that style to them. A little mm-hmm. bit. 
But uh, anyways, guys, thank you for watching. For the Board Game Rundown, I've been Tim. I've been Bob. I've been Spencer. I've been Dan. We'll see you real soon. Hey, guys, I'm Tim. I'm Bob. I'm Spencer. I'm Dan. And this is the Board Game Rundown. Today, we are going to unbox IDW's Ghostbuster Men in B- Ghostbusters Men in Black Extra... Extra- Ecto-terrestrial. I wanted to say extra. <laughs> Thanks for checking out the Board Game Rundown. If you like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Share our videos on social media and spread the word. We publish new content weekly, including reviews, unboxing, and Let's Plays. And as always, thanks for watching.